Ladies and gentlemen, uh, good morning. Uh, I am honored to greet in the Parliament of Georgia Secretary General of NATO Anders Fogh Rasmussen and to welcome the delegation of amb ambassadors uh, to NATO. As you know, today we have the NAC meeting in Parliament of Georgia. It is a very important meeting, uh, you know, and such meetings usually reflect the special kind of relations that are between NATO and this partner Kartney. This is the country, this is the second occasion that in Georgia we have such a meeting here in Tbilisi, and I think it is uh, one of the proofs and evidences of the such special deep relations that exist between NATO and Georgia. It's a very significant fact for us that after Bucharest summit, after 2008, we can say just uh, that now Georgia is closer to NATO than it has ever been. Now Georgia is closer to NATO than it was in Bucharest, for instance, three years ago. And it's very important for us to continue this pro process of approximation, of coming closer. And of course, uh, in this cooperation, the ultimate goal for us is membership of Georgia in NATO to achieve the task, uh, the aim, which is clearly elaborated in the decision of Bucharest summit, a partnership of Georgia and NATO. It is a success story. It has a successful development. And after Bucharest, very many changes, uh, very many things changed in our relations. We have uh, very many elements, components for necessary for success. We have annual plan, uh, national plan. In accordance with ANP, we cooperate with NATO on annual basis. We have NATO-Georgia Commission. It is a very important tool on the way to approximation and accession. And of course, we have obligation to, of Bucharest and aspiration and the desire of NATO that was clearly formulated that Georgia will become the member. And when we implement all these elements successfully, this is a condition for Georgia, that Georgia will become the member of NATO. And today, I can declare that we are, Georgia is closer to NATO than we have ever been during our history. And we hope that the next summit, Chicago summit, will be one more possibility to evidence the success in our relations. And I hope that one more step will be made uh, forward to approximation, to coming closer to NATO from the side of Georgia. And of course, we understand also that we have to do a lot for this process, for the success of this process. So that is why uh, the success of Georgia, becoming Georgia, modern European country, continuing reforms, strengthening reforms, deepening these reforms, all this creates the precondition. So together with all the above mentioned tools, Georgia's integration in NATO to become successful. It is interest of Georgia, and I'm sure that it is also NATO's interest, and I hope that by our joint efforts we will be able to achieve this ultimate goal. Once more, let me express gratitude gratitude to NATO Secretary General for his support. We have listened many times to his supporting position about Georgia, about Georgia's territorial integrity, about Georgia's Euro-Atlantic aspirations. And let me express gratitude to him personally, to members of NAC as well. And I hope that this two-day visit in Georgia will be successful and it will facilitate us in deepening, in further deepening of Georgia NATO relations. And let me ask now Mr. Secretary General of NATO to, to take the floor. Thank you very much, uh, Chairman Bakatsa, and I have uh, had a very fruitful uh, meeting uh, this morning, and it is a great pleasure for the NATO Council uh, to visit uh, your uh, parliament, uh, because parliament uh, is the keystone uh, of democracy, and democracy is uh, the keystone of Georgia's uh, future. Uh, the Georgian people uh, want to live in a modern and mature uh, democracy. Um, and as an alliance of values and democracies, NATO wants to see that happen. Uh, Georgia has already achieved much. Today we discussed uh, your 
uh, progress in consolidating the rule of law and democracy and looked at the challenges uh, that lie ahead. Um, next year, uh, Georgian uh, citizens uh, will elect uh, a new uh, parliament. Those elections will be an important indicator of how strong Georgia's democratic institutions are. Georgia is already a strong partner, and I look forward to the day when you will be a strong member of our alliance, as we agreed um, at our Bucharest summit uh, in uh, 2008. Membership for any country takes work, reforms, and commitment, and Parliament will continue to uh, play an essential role uh, in this. And uh, with uh, patience and with perseverance, uh, that work can be done. NATO wants Georgia to do it, and NATO will help you to do it.